Hey guys, in this tutorial I'll walk you through some of the tricks from my last video and I'm gonna show you how you can create a simple portal effect in Adobe After Effects. Let's get right into it. First we'll create this shot where I jump into the portal. This is the original shot we'll be working with. Also make sure to record a clean plate. Now let's fire up After Effects. The clean plate shot goes on the bottom of the timeline and the main shot on top of that. We can start by creating a hole in the floor. So take the pen tool and draw a mask. Then change the mask blending mode to subtract. Now duplicate the main shot and let's call it body. Since we want to animate the body to go through the portal, we need to create a selection of it. For this I'm gonna use the Roto Brush tool. Also create this selection for multiple frames to make it more realistic, so that we don't have to use just a single frame for the jump. Then freeze the selection. Tweak the settings. And this is what we've got now. Now enable animation for position, go a few frames ahead and move the body down the hall. Next move the clean plate shot to the start of the jump and place it above the main shot and below the body. Then duplicate the clean plate shot and place it on top of the timeline. Adjust the mask to cover the outside of the hole. To make the animation go smoother, enable Motion Blur and right-click the keyframe, choose Easy is Out and Easy is In. Now bring in the wall image and make it 3D so we can line it up with the floor. I'll also create a black solid and use a mask to create a shadow. To create the opening animation of the portal, enable animation for the mask path and adjust it to get the desired look. And that's basically it. Now we can pre-compose it, add some camera movement and color grading. Next let's take a look at the second scene. In the original shot I used a green screen which we'll replace afterwards and we'll also add some trees on the right side. So let's bring it into After Effects and remove the green screen. Now we can place a background in here. Next bring in the garden shot and position it accordingly. Then create a mask around the wall. Next create an orange solid and set the blending mode to add. Again create a mask to kind of imitate the sunlight. Feather it a bunch and reduce the opacity as well. For the tree in the foreground I used a simple transparent image. Then I added a shadow on the wall. And to make the tree move around a bit I used the mesh warp effect and keyframe the distortion mesh. Finally, I added some green screen flies. Now pre-compose everything and top it all with some fake camera movement and color grading.
In the last shot I use the green screen again and replace it with a garden shot. Then I keyframe the position and scale of the garden shot to make it look like the camera goes through the portal. And we are done. If you found this helpful please consider subscribing and I'll see you in the next video.